Good morning, it's David Wiegener here. This is my version, uh, further my version of um, Sudoku. Um, so I'm bringing you Sudoku, it's not chess. So it's just the way I look at the game Sudoku. So here we go, and it's a medium out of the, um, the Christchurch Press newspaper um, of about nine days ago. So I got this puzzle then. So I'll just put it on my um, my game for Sudoku for the um, computer. So here we go. So the date today is the 15th of August 2017. Now I'll just um, focus in a bit and so here we go. Right, so now I'd start with number one, okay? Now I did see one before, here's one here straight away because can't go here, can't go there, so it just goes here. So only a one can go here and here. La la la. And so now we go number two. Uh, what are there any obvious twos here? Yes, there's one here, which I saw before. There's one here somewhere. Number three. So I'm just going to skill daddle through these um, ones first. Not ones, but threes. And we'll just do fours now. And we'll do uh, fives now. So we're not going to muck around with these um, numbers too much yet. Tool. Uh, so here we've got a five here or here, okay? So five can only be, the five can't go in here because it's already so um, this is a five along here. So we know that this is a five here somewhere. Uh, no, we don't. Sorry, I'm talking out. I'm talking out the side of the square there. Uh, the five can be here or here or here, here or here or here or here or here. It can't be there, of course. So anyway, number six. <coughs> Without further ado, number six can either be here or here, here or here or here, and here. It cannot be anywhere else. So this is all these spaces are taken. So this is a six, most definitely here. Number seven. Moving on. Move seven. Number seven. We have got. A seven here and a seven here and we've got no seven can go there because there's a seven here or here because this is a seven down here so this is going to be a seven somewhere okay but it can't be there so we know that, that seven is there and then we know this seven is here okay <coughs> then what have we got um, we've got um, eight obviously so eight is the next number so eight can only go here because it can't go there, it can't go there on this box. It can only go here and here. So that's an 8 here and here. And that's an 8 here and here and here. And that's an 8 here and here and here. Okay, and here's an 8 here and here and here. And here we can see that that's not an 8 there because this is an 8 along here or 8 along here already. So there's already an 8 along here, this line here. And there's already an 8 down here. So we know that, that that is an 8 there, so that is an 8 there somewhere. Because that can't be an 8 because that one here before mentioned. So that's an 8 there somewhere. Same as this is an 8 here somewhere. So we've got 1, 2, uh, we'll just do the 9s first, um, David. So we'll stick to the program. We know that that's a 9 straight away instantly. It's a 1 that's um, eyeballing us. It's a clear 9 because the 9 can't go in any other block at all, any other square in the 9 squares. So now we'll go back to 1 and see if we've done anything that's transformed the position in our favour. Not quite yet, <coughs> but it's not bad. We might only be able to put a 1 and another number in those two boxes and then we can determine which is a 1 and a 7. So we can do that. We can do, I like to just put, like I've said in the other ones, 
I like to put where there's only two numbers that can go in a square I like to put them in um, because I just like doing it now we know that, that 1 and 3 and 7 cannot go in that area so we attack that square now that square right there where my mouse is that square right there we now look at that because it looks like a weakness because 3 can only go there and there okay can only go there and there so we know that's a 3 so it obliterates other 3's in its direction and by the way I've just seen a 3 here so a bit um, silly not seeing that yet um, because can't go there, can't go there so the 3 goes there so we know a 3's here and here somewhere and we know a 3's here or here or here I'm not completely sure yet where so then we have, um, and these are threes, so we know that this square here, which I'm talking about, is not a three, but there has to be a three here and here. So now we can go, so that is a three there. So that's a three there or there, or there and there. Those two places are where threes are, and those two boxes here. Whereas this box is a 3 here, so I'm going to attack this square right now. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. It's an 8. See that? See, I'm saying that this is an 8 and that's an 8. Okay? It's, it's coming together a wee bit, but not that much. That's an 8, because it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, seven eight nine so i found the weakness straight away because i saw a three when i saw a one seven and i saw there was a three there on its right side so i knew that that was a weak point in the camp of the game so that's number eight these are eights here and these are eights here or here and here and here or here and here and here but it cannot be here as I've aforementioned because that's an 8 somewhere here. Now we know straight away that that's the 8 there. Can you see why? I'll explain. The reason why is that can't go there of course, can't go there and can't go there. But we already worked out that there was an 8 here and here and we've just filled one in. So that's an 8. Next are we... Uh, to attack the sevens are looking quite weak here see there's a seven there and a seven there and a one there okay so that's pretty qu reasonably quick but it's not not as fast as the champions are the one goes here okay and um, then there's a one here and here and there's a one here and here one 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 two we've got um, is we've got a corresponding 2 here and here and a 2 here and here which they counter each other this one's a 2 okay obvious reasons I'm not going to go into detail for that because then people would be annoyed with that I would be annoyed with stating the obvious 3 is much the same as before so then we've got one two three four five so there's a five okay because that can't be a five in this box so we know that these two numbers here I'll fill them in because I like doing it that's me possibly cheating one, two, three, four, five, a six. And that can't be a six, so it's a six there and a three there. Okay. So now we've now filled in another three, haven't we? Now we've got this three covered. Because that three cannot go here or along here. And this one's already. And now we've got one of the things I miss in this game. Is the obvious move we've got 
eight out of nine um, squares filled in here so we can fill one in which is a four okay so then we know that this is a four and that this is definitely a four because there's no other place for the four along this line to go uh, can't go here because there's not allowed to have two fours in there so that's a four and we know that this is a four and this is a four somewhere and this is a four somewhere etc so now we look for other holes in the position are there any obvious 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 um, moves David yes there is there's this one that's um, yelling out to me it's a number two we can only go two here because and a two here so we've just done all the twos now we've done all the nine twos one two three four five six seven eight nine we've done all the twos these numbers here can only be a one and a five so we can put them in I don't mind if you don't you know like you if you don't like uh, it that I do that then that's okay number five here and number five here okay um, that's filled them in rather reasonably so the number fives now we've got the obvious closure here of this block which or the Dutch call in um, rummy cum uh, the um, this no, it's the um, key what's this, this um, sorry I forgot the word they call it the closure but the slotal I think just the key the lock the slotal I think it's meaning the slotal is the lock I think that's what it means but please don't quote me um, so we've got the obvious closure here which is nine okay now we've got a nine here a nine here a nine here or here so it's been a wee bit difficult the nine but it's not too bad so have we got any other obvious closures David because David misses the closures the obvious um, at times so you know even in chess I miss the obvious move at times not always but I do miss the obvious move or the obvious blunder that I've done and my mum says I shouldn't be saying that but you know it's actually good for me because I teach myself to like in this game here which is good practice for me to um, think about looking out for the obvious so we've done two so I don't need to that's obvious we do not have to do the twos we've got a three here so is there any other number there that can only go there no not particularly because four can go there too so I'm not going to because three and four cannot go there the four but the four can go there three can go there and there but then there's also four can go there now here we've got have a look at this now I'm just going to fill these in for fun and here and here so okay we can only put threes here and here now we can't put threes um, here or here as well because we have to put threes in three boxes of nine numbers so we can't put um, three lots of three in two boxes we have to um, put one three in this box here and because these are both on the top rank I'll call it and the bottom rank and the top rank and the bottom rank we know that if there was a th uh, an empty space here the five wasn't there we know that one of these spaces here to correspond with those three that um, reflect off each other sort of thing we would know that a three would be here or here 
and so in this case we know that this is a three this is a three um, and that sort of thing okay so these threes are still un unavailable to us now we've got one two three four five a six okay and then we've got six and then we've got six and then we've got this closure which is um, eight and then we know that's an eight because it can't be there because of that one can't be there because of that one that we've just put in can't be there so we put the eight there straight away we know that the eight goes there here's another eight and here's another eight okay then we've got um, the next set of moves is this is a one we know that or I know that or you know that we both know that that's a one here somewhere but it can't be there so we could attack that square one two three four five six seven eight nine so that can be a one or nine so we'll do that just for the fun okay because I love it so we know that that's a nine there and we know that that's a nine there and we also know that that's a nine there so that's a nine there so nine can't go there, can't go there because of that nine. So it's a nine and that's a one. One? No, I was wrong. I was, uh, that was the other number I put in there. It was a four. And that's a four. Okay, and we're closing it all up. It's just going, it's just going all to pieces now for Sudoku. It's just winning the whole game. Five. Five goes in there, and uh, we know that they're fives, and we know that they're fives, or they can be fives, and they can be fives. So we're not, I'm not completely sure where the fives go yet, but I know that that has to be a five or there, and that could be a five and whatever. I'm just going to waffle there. So we know that that's a three. And we know it's not a one, see? It's not a one, because we've got a one up there, Dave. So that's a five. And that's a one. And that's a one. Okay? And so that's almost finished the game. Now we've got these threes. Now we've got one, two, three, four, obviously. And there's a four. Okay, and then we've got a four here, and um, we have a three there, and a three there. So this is a, oh, the uh, the um, wrong number, of course. So we've got its closure, isn't it? The whole thing's closing down. Okay, that's the end of the session, and that was 10 minutes, um, 19 minutes, 19.